Now's the time. I'm going to start cranking out some jump scares. Let's see how the jump scare looks. I That's a pretty so <laughs> Hi. Uh it's me. I should have made this video a long time ago. Two months ago on Twitter, I did another one of those tweets asking you guys to reply with a whole bunch of FNAF fan games, and the top three most liked would, uh, be in this video. And then two months passed, so, sorry, life happened. Look, better late than never, I've gone through, you guys have voted, and I have picked out three scrumptious games for us to play today. I don't know why I'm describing them as scrumptious, maybe I'm just hungry. Man, I want some spaghetti. So here you go, three random FNAF fan games that you guys chose on Twitter. Let's do this. Oh, and like, subscribe, hit the bell, do all the things, because you're awesome. Did you know I have a TikTok now? Eh, go figure. Link in the description. Coming in with the third most likes this time is After Nights at Bobby's, which is a dreams game. I always love playing dreams games. I'm still working on the Platinum Trophy, like two years later. Apparently they're really excited they got 500 likes, so hey, maybe it'll be good. I mean, the graphics so far look very detailed as it goes for Dreams FNAF games. Oh my god, don't be loud! I'm gonna lower that, that's just introducing who made the game, alright. Hello? How can I help you? What is this? Oh! The newspaper has arrived! Security guard job available. Help wanted. It's at the same place my dad used to work at. $7.25 an hour is certainly better than nothing. That's true. Not very much though. After Nights of Bobby's. Heck yeah. We got a little bit of lore there. Maybe maybe this is the daughter of uh Michael Schmidt? Whatever his name is. I'm I'm forgetting all the names of the night guards in the actual game. Anyways, let's do this. I, I hope this is terrifying. Like, this, I feel, has some potential. Bobby works very simply. He goes through every cam and goes to your left door. Close the door before he attacks. Cool. Is that all I have to worry about? Oh, no, not at all. Noah works the same way as Bobby. She goes through every cam, goes to my right. Okay. Witty. Okay, makes things a little more complicated. You need to look at her very freak, freak, frequently. Free, frequent, frequently. <laughs> throughout the night. Keep an eye on her before she attacks. All right. Mike works the same way as Witty. Look at him the exact moment the clock turns to the hour that shows on his sign. Uh, okay. We even get a night guard. Heck yeah. I'm not nervous. Are you nervous? Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I know that. I know that. Phone guy. Goodbye. All of that I knew. You don't have to reteach me the gay. Oh my god. Hi. Okay. I don't like how the puppet's active. He's a big old butt, isn't he? All right. I understand how Mike works. I, earlier, that dude sitting on my power did something super weird. He like let me know that it was about to turn See, like that, and that lets me know I need to watch Mike if I need to, like, go to Mike. So, that's really, okay, that's really good to know. That's really good to know, that helps out. Oh my god, okay, that's, okay, I pressed the wrong button. But seriously, just a dev note to anyone who currently makes FNAF fan games, I feel like 
the phone guy is redundant at this point. You don't have to teach me how to turn on the flashlighter that I have to conserve power. You, like, you don't need to speak for, like, five minutes about that. Like, I got it covered. Like, trust me. I really like this location. It's really neato. Hi. Th which one are you? Are you Noah? But basically, it seems like um, the main two characters, Bobby and Noah now? What is your name? N-O-A? Was that it? Yes. I'm pretty sure those two characters just appear to the left or the right, and I just shut my door, and I'll be able to see them. So I really don't have to pay too much attention. Um, but where where's the foxy one? I would like the puppet to go away. Thank you very much. Oh. Okay. That's a cool cutout. Oh. No, thank you. As far as Dreams FNAF fan games go, this is pro- like, just, just- and again, I haven't even beaten the first night, but as far as the controls go, it feels very fluid. Like, I think this is one of the best Dreams FNAF fan games I've played so far. It's almost time for Mike. It's almost time for Mike. It's Mike time, baby! He's ready, he's excited! He's had way too much coffee! Begin the magic show! Oh, now magic show starts at 6. Okay, gotta I gotta watch him at 6 o'clock as well. It's just like that character from the Ultimate Custom Night. I can't remember exactly who that was, but... Like, the character that you had to always, like, look at at the exact time. Who's whispering sweet nothings in the pizzeria. If you could shut up, that'd be cool. Man, I did a terrible job conserving power tonight. Eh, what can you do? It's fine. It's the first night. Magic time. It's magic time, baby. 6 a.m. Why, why is there a little triangle of death? Doesn't matter, I win. Night one complete. This is the most somber celebration of 6 a.m. I've ever heard. Use the radio to find key. Restart the power manually. What is this? Excuse me? Time. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Crap! Oh, God! It's turned free roam. Find the ra- I gotta find the radio. I don't have that much time. Ooh! Ooh! Where's my- There's my run. There we go. Oh, my God! Oh! Woo! I know I lost. Look out for animatronics. Oh, thank you. I I, I I had no idea. Okay, so so this isn't optional. <laughs> um, where's the radio? Oh, use the radio. I have the radio. Okay. Oh. Whoever's there, go away, please. Excuse me, Bobby. 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 Bobby, heal that boy ain't right! Bobby! Bobby! Oh, hello. Four children went missing last week. We believe one of the animatronics, Mike, is to blame because the- oh, I'm trying to read your floor! Don't you want me to understand your game a little bit better, you stupid animatronic? Oh my god. Can I, like, go nowhere? I would like to explore. I'm really not sure how to use the radio here. Like, I am really failing. Can I go into the kitchen? It's locked. Oh. Here's Witty's room. Is it in here? Staff only. I'm, I am running out of time. Party's over. Oh, God. I like the details that I've gotten in this game. I like the attention to detail. I, I, just, I just wish I knew what I was doing. Can I just leave? This is not worth seven fifty an hour. Uh, I'm almost out of time. What happens when I run out of time? Three, two, one. What happens? I just die. Yeah, I, I lose. Okay. Here's the deal. I gotta move on. I got. I gotta move on with this video and play more games. But I like this. This is really cool. Let me know if you want me to return to this because. I'm always on the lookout for playing more dream games. Also, tell me what the hell I'm doing with the key, because obviously I, I don't know how to use the radio appropriately, and uh, that is an angry animatronic. And I'm going to give it a like. Yeah. 
Hey, would you look at that? Another dreams game. You guys know me so well. Welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's Unmasked. It also looks like Freddy has a monocle in this one, which I'm super excited to see. I don't know why. Oh, he's got a little cigar hanging out. This is a high class man right here. Freddy's getting a little bougie. This is a love letter to the original series in its entirety made specifically for the eighth anniversary. Ooh, I like the title of this one. Five Nights at Freddy's Unmasked. New game. Family Pizzeria looking for a security guard to work the night shift, 12 to 6. Uh, look at all the things, don't die. Uh, $120 a week, okay. Okay. Now this is an office. Oh god. Hi! Job. Great! I've actually worked in that office before. Uh, I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact. So, uh, I'll do you a favor. For the rest of the week, uh, I'll be calling you, you know, giving you advice. Before I go ahead and tell you anything about your, uh, surroundings, uh, I have these papers I have to read. Okay. Uh, it, it's kind of like a legal thing, uh... You know, the whole shipping, the whole deal. Sure. <clears throat> uh, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person upon discovering that damage or death has occurred. He sounds so sarcastic. Now that sounds bad. Really nothing to worry about. You'll be fine. Oh, I know I will be fine. Hold on, I, I gotta get a new controller. All right, new controller. We are set. I am pretty sure the phone call is very similar to just the original phone call from FNAF 1, but it just sounds super sarcastic. I like it a lot. I don't know. Now, uh, concerning you, yep. you may have Naturally. If you have not noticed, uh, there's a little screen on your chair. That's the Freddy Fazbear's patented portable, as long as it's connected to the wall, camera system. Woo! Yeah, camera. I'll quickly go over the doors. Uh, the Press the button to close the doors. I already figured that out. Phone guy. Okay, have a good time at Freddy Fazbear's. Appreciate it. Get out of here. All right. Same note on the phone call. I don't need all of like if you want to give exposition uh, to the game, that's totally fine. But you don't need to tell me how the cameras and doors work. I think I got it covered. However, I am curious if there is a foxy type character. Probably. Yeah, in Cam's. Uh, what is that? That's got to be Cam Five Pirates Cove. Yeah, so that's definitely gonna be where Freddy is. I mean, Foxy. I really want a Freddy jump scare. I <laughs> I want Freddy to jump scare me in this one and be like, Bye, Jove, I've got you! Freddy hasn't moved, but then again, is that the animatronic or is that just a picture of Freddy? Like, I would not be surprised if Freddy jump scared me like with like a giant bag of money, you know, that like the robbers use to like rob a bank where it just has like the money symbol on it and just smacks me with it and I die. Huh! <gasps> Wait, wait, there you go. Bonnie's active. I can still see that Bonnie's there. His face is shoved up against the little window that I have there on the door. I do want to see a bunch of jump scares from this one, but we'll 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 cross that bridge when we get there. Was that the sound of you leaving? Yes, it was. Okay, I like this detail to sound. Everyone watching who follows me on Twitter uh, and voted for this game and the last one, by the way, follow me on Twitter, uh, thank you. Uh, this is a delight in terms of just... I see you, Foxy. Well, I just, I just appreciate how well this game moves, especially for a Dreams game. Because that's the thing about Dreams games, they're always shots in the dark. You never know what you're going to get. Come on, Foxy. It's about to be 6 a.m. What you gonna do about it? Gonna come get me? I don't think so. You don't have the time. 
I like all the details in the office. Like, it's super cluttered, and there's, like, stuff everywhere. But you get a whole bunch of, like, neat references from all the past games. Interesting 6 a.m. from a grandfather clock. But you're not done yet. Oh, thank you. Thank you for reminding me. Heck yeah. All right, what, 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 what's the phone guy got to say? Uh, hello? Hey, nice job, man. Did not expect you to make it this far. Oh. Uh, not bad I'm implying something else. Uh, you know, typically people would move on with their life and do something else. Sure. I don't blame them. Uh, I personally find the place quite creepy myself. The decor combined with the darkness and, uh, Yeah. Could you imagine if they had legs? Speaking of which, what? Uh, check on Pirate's Cove. What? Wait. You won't see him, but Foxy is inside. I think it's best that you focus on your job, uh, Good night. Good night. What was that about them not having legs? Do these animatronics not have legs? I understand. So, they're literally torsos in kind of like the wall and they move around like a moving painting but they're an animatronic okay all right i i accept what was that why did the camera go like that is there a reason the camera went like that should i be worried should i be able to see someone in the camera oh hello may i help you that looks like a chef's hat is that chica you gonna make me some pizza <sighs> Man, there's something about being a night guard nowadays that just makes me sleepy. 3 a.m., halfway there. It is in the middle of the night, so makes sense for me to be tired. It's night two, it's 4 a.m. No, oh my god! I was about to say no animatronic has come to attack me yet, but I am now sorely mistaken. Well, then again, it took four hours for Bonnie to even think about coming over and try to attack me, which... Whatever. Scamp, run out of here, Bonnie. I'm betting I'm gonna get Chica this night. I saw her moving. She's gone from this camera. I'm doing a real good job of... Oh, God. I, I saw the mask on the wall. I, like, hesitated for a sec. It's Everything's fine. What was I talking about? Foxy. Foxy's staying away. That's good. I keep checking Freddy. Freddy doesn't want to move. I want to get far enough into this game where I can get a Freddy jump scare. Like, that is my ultimate goal for this game now. Okay, now you're active, Bonnie! Okay, I see you now! 5 a.m., baby, let's go! Pretty nice how it's 5 a.m. and I still have, like, over half of my power. That's, like, solid. I mean, then again, they're not really attacking me. Hi, Foxy, I see you. That's fine. They need to be more active. The, the devs of this game should have, like, upped the ante just a little bit. At least for night two. It makes me nervous. Oh, three. Okay, Bonnie's attacked me three times and I can't close the door. Close the door. Oh! 6 a.m. It's fine. I was paying attention. That was all purposeful. The mask is gone. Why is the mask gone? So, uh, did you know the animatronics have legs? Yeah. They used to walk around and interact with kids. You said they didn't have legs. Ah. Yeah, it's yeah. surprising how long a person can live without a phone. Yeah. I think that should be it. Go! <laughs> what was that? Okay, I thought he was getting to the point to be like, yep, you know, we didn't want them, you know, attacking people anymore, so we just took their legs and hoped that would solve the problem. I think that's what he was getting at, which I think is a hilarious solution. All right, 2 a.m. All right, come on, big boy, let's do it. Come on, I want to see your jump scare. I know Chica's moving. Do I seriously need to wait until 4 a.m. for an animatronic to attack me again? Freddy moved! Freddy moved! Freddy! Freddy! Fred! Where'd you go, buddy? <laughs> what was that view of Chica? I'm so... Oh, God. Oh, Chica's near me. 
Chica's, ne Chica's nearby. Oh, Chica. Oh, Chica! Oh, okay. I'm, I'm gonna have to see all these jump scares in a second, but I, I kind of at least want to get to, to, to Freddy. Oh, wow. Who's that? Oh, it's Bonnie. Are you gone? Okay. That's good. That's good. Okay. They're active. Oh, they're active. Oh, night three is a doozy. Is Freddy gonna do the weird thing where he sneaks into my office and I don't even know and then he jump scares me like two minutes later? That's basically what happened in the original game. It's like Freddy would sneak into your into your office if you like leave this door open. Which I've, I've never seen that specific mechanic replicated in any FNAF game. I'm hoping this is the first game to do that. Oh, what? What, 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 what? Stop doing that. It's 5 a.m. and I've only been attacked by one animatronic once. Come on. Up the ante a little bit. Make me nervous. No, sir, Bonnie. No, sir, I want to see your jump scare, but not at a 5 a.m. Oh, 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 oh. Was that Foxy? So, I'm not sure what just happened. Are we okay? Six, eight, okay. What was that? <laughs> I thought I was watching Foxy like a hawk. That was Foxy, wasn't it? I swore it was. Hello, phone guy. Okay, I wasn't sure what was happening in the phone call or what was like happening in the game. All right, they are super active. Hopefully I get a lot more scares. Now's the time I'm gonna start cranking out some jump scares. Let's see how the jump scare looks. I That's a pretty so oh! oh my God. Was that the puppet? Is there a puppet? There's a music box. There's a music box? Wait, is there a music box? That was the puppet, right? There's no other explanation that I would suspect. There's a music box. Sneaky to just throw that in there. Did I just hear Balloon Boy say hello? Is there a Balloon Boy in this game? Hold on, hold the phone. Is there? Balloon boy? Oh, God, stop doing that! Oh my God. Actually, you know what? Bonnie, I wanna see your jump scare. Yo, let's do this. Bonnie, let's let's do this, buddy. Let's do this, big Bonnie. Oh my God! I like these jump scares. I like these jump scares. I wanna see Chica and Freddy. I wanna see Chica and Freddy. Hello? Wait, is that Foxy already out? Yo, Foxy! Yo, Foxy, come get me! I'm gonna see your jump scare. There he is. There he goes. <gasps> Did Foxy have a beret on? Why are they all fancy? You know what, what am I doing? I'm gonna close the doors, and I'm just gonna sit here with the power on. I'm gonna waste power. I'm gonna see what happens uh, when the lights go off. I will see my Freddy Fazbear's jump scare. That is annoying. Who was that? Oh crap, I forgot, wait, wait. I forgot about the puppet. There's a puppet. Hold on, I should probably like still worry about the puppet. We're okay. Power off, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I see that monocle. Don't think I don't see how fancy you are. Hit me with a big old sack of money. This is a long Toreador march. It was a very long Toreador march. 
I've never heard this part of the Toreador march. It went on for so long. Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Come on, money bags. Okay. Look, if I don't get Chica's jump scare, you know, what am I doing? Come on, Chica. I know you want to jump scare me. Just a little bit further. You're almost there. I see you, Freddy, peeking around the corner. I already got your jump scare. I just need Chica to come get me. Oh, there you are. It's like, my goodness. All right. Oh, my God. Oh, God. All right. <laughs> Relax. That was really cool. I liked it. I liked that a lot. Very good for a Dreams FNAF fan game. You did it! You finally made me do it! We're finally back to the Return to Freddy's. Legendary edition, for the third one at least. I have a lot of memories about the Return to Freddy's. I played pretty much the entire series, like within the first year of my channel being up. So like, this is a series from like eight years ago. I don't know what it means for this game to be the Legendary Edition. It is so shocking that it just has been given the Legendary status. <laughs> Heroes are made from playing this game. All right, let's do it. Let's see what we got. New game, Fazbear Fantasyland. I remember that thing. It looked, it still looks weird, quite frankly. Uh, okay. Let's, let's go die a lot. Click to read about the enemies you will encounter. Eh, it's fine. Who cares about reading? Oh, I even get a phone call. I mean, the phone guy's gonna tell me what to do, right? Oh, I remember this! This takes me back. Okay, we have all this stuff. Hey, Blake. How's it going? Great! Uh, you're probably wondering why we called you to help us out with this job. Yes. Well, things get pretty heavy over here. And there's a lot of pretty cool stuff that I think you'll like. Perfect. Uh, anyways, back to business. Yeah! We're going to change the name a bit and call it Fazbear Fantasy Land. There is pretty much only two things to watch for. I heard a lot of rumors that the animatronics move around at night. Yeah? This gives me the chills, so just keep an eye on the two am- Do! Do! I just- that, That's a secret minigame. The kitty corner. Okay. I was just clicking around, I'm sorry. I move slow. Can I move faster, please? Like, a little faster? I need to help the children. Is there a sprint button? Is there a pounce on the ch- Oh, oh, oh! Oh! W-A-S-D instead of the arrow keys. Okay, see, that's much better. See, I'm actually moving my feet. All right. Okay, I, I guess, okay. My, grab this stick. Okay, magic trick. What do you want me to do, game? Oop. I didn't mean to do that. Oh god. Oh god, what have I done? I accidentally hit a button that made it go full screen. I didn't want that. No, stop. I, I see you. I'm trying to fix it, okay? Relax. Okay, fixed it. I still don't know what I'm doing. I, I didn't mean to do that. What what button is making that happen? The, stop. Don't move. Two thousand years later. All right, I gave up and I just dove into the game. I also muted the phone call because I, I forgot where I was and I get it. Just watch out for the animatronics. They're trying to make a whole new happy place, even though it doesn't look too happy. I do remember like it like it's like an, like I'm like an owl, right? I just swivel my head like all the way across this entire place. I would like to know who's after me. Hello? Pretty music. Is this what makes this game legendary? Oh, oh I see you. Do I have to worry about a vent? I swore I heard a vent happening. Isn't there a snake animatronic in this game? Virgo or Vigo or something? Like, I vaguely remember a snake animatronic because that's a good idea. Maybe I should have read the instructions. <laughs> Hi there, whoever you are. Are you Freddy? You don't exactly look like Freddy. Okay, you're gone. View animatronic. Okay, maybe I can't do that. Light system, oh god. Okay. So I can turn off the light if I want to. Oh my god, Bonnie! I think that was Bonnie. Was that Bonnie? 
God! Okay, let's retry. Let's do that. What about door lock system? Oh, is that to, like, repair the door lock system? And then, uh, maybe the same thing with corrupt signal? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Maybe it's an issue, like, if I see an animatronic, I shut off the light. Well, then again, that probably doesn't work for Bonnie, because I died in the middle of the darkness. Wait, the darkness doesn't trigger Bonnie, does it? I'm gonna double check. It's worth trying. No, okay. Bonnie just happened to be near me. Bonnie Buttface. Where are you, friend? Oh, hi. Are you he? Oh, God. Hello? Everyone be nice. <laughs> I just looked around for you! Where where did Bonnie come from? Ah, Bonnie will slip in if I don't close the door to make her backtrack. What about this person? Kitty! Kitty follows the same path as Bonnie, but the doors only halt her movement. Once she's gone from Cam 2, quickly shut off the lights. I see. Okay. What's with the music? What's what, what's with the classical music? Who's playing the piano? Who, who, who's got this brilliant musical talent right now? Toggle door! You ain't getting me! Ha ha! Bonnie, back off! Ha ha! Is he? That's, that's how you do it. Is that Kitty? I'm gonna toggle the door. Wait, no, wait, no, 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 wait, 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 no. It, it's if you leave... No, no, no. Toggle the door. And then... You're gonna disappear and I'm gonna shut off the light. That's what I gotta do. Come on, do your thing, disappear. But then also toggle door for you, and then lights off. And that saves me from the cat. Yes, we good? What, what, what? Oh, door lock system, okay. Didn't have to freak out on me. I was, I was looking up like what actually makes this the legendary edition. I thought I had time! Okay, so basically this is a recode of the game. So this dude rebuilt the game from the ground up, rebalanced enemies, uh, made Night 6 and Night 8 stand out more. I mean, uh, I, there's gonna be a link in the description to this game, and so you can look to see everything that's been uh, change and like what's different. I know there's like a lot of people who really enjoy the Return to Freddy series and so you guys are going to be picking up a lot more on that than me just kind of skimming through. But yeah, I mean this game, uh, like fr from a player's perspective, uh, coming back to the Return to Freddy's 3 like seven to eight years later, I mean, you know, still looks like the same game to me more or less, I don't know. Maybe if I played the original Return to Freddy's 3, uh, maybe the Legendary Edition will stand out more, but, eh, I digress. And there you have it! Three random FNAF fan games chosen by you on Twitter. Which, by the way, go follow me on Twitter. Um, I do these every once in a while, so, uh, be sure to be on the lookout for tweets for me to, uh, you know, ask you guys for suggestions about stuff. Oh yeah, and I do suppose I have a TikTok or whatever. Link in the description. I really like doing these. I hope you really enjoyed this time around. Uh, and I hope you guys keep giving me really cool suggestions. I re like every time that I do one of these, I'm like, wow, I've never heard of this game. Or like, wow, this game is cool. Uh, you guys know what's up. And you guys more than often know what I like in general. But that's going to be it for me. Thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end card at the end of this video. Also be sure to like and subscribe if you have not already done so. I love you guys so much. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy, stay happy. And I will see you guys later, goodbye. Yeah, this has nothing to do with Five Nights at Freddy's. This is the loading screen for Dreams. And uh, why is there a banana kaiju over there? I, I, sorry, I saw that and it threw me off. I'm just saying. I think it's cool, like a banana kaiju. I would actually love to see a horror game about that. Huh.